They yeah. talked a lot of shit to Cali, but they, they really showed up for Cali, you know? There's like, so the people that don't know, Zyme and uh, Guru share an apartment. Yeah. And they hosted like five people from SoCal. The host, the house of Zuru, as it's called. Yeah, Zuru. And Hyper already going so aggro. Well, so here's Zelda's biggest issue, right? She she handles pressure kind of weird, not not too well. So you're right. Hyper can throw it on there. Wow, super quick stock there from. And I wonder if, if like, do you think Zyme's ever seen anything like this? You know, this specific type of a Lucas, like this is. I know Nark, you know, but this is different. You can tell it's different, you know. Yeah. Oh. He nice. don't care. That was some, some sick DI. <laughs> the DI's been getting rough, man. As the night starts to crawl. Wow, what a spot dodge there from Zyme. But it's not going to work if he keeps on, if he multi magnets it. Spot dodge will be punished by a multi magnet. One thing that's so strong about uh, when you like multi shining, multi magnets. Wow. What an interesting option there by Hyper. We haven't seen him pull that instant PK Thunder 2 very often. Okay, keeping him in the air. Oh, knocks him right into the dins. Yeah, that should kill him. Yep. Ooh, I love when he does the fold the magnet to up there. It looks so cool. Like, he just does a super fast retreating headbutt, you know? Yeah. I'm just, I, I'm just like kind of seeing how Zion is reacting to, to this match, you know? Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to see what the adaptation is. Maybe Din's fire doesn't come out as often when it's up close. He's or, a huge Din user. Yeah. His Din's place. Oh. Oh, oh my god! My is that freaking real? That's a thing. That's gonna make a huge difference. It's so good that he, for him, that he found that out in game one. Dude, what if he knew? The thing is, are we gonna see a lot more tethers now from Hyper? That's worse though. Like you're forcing, you're forcing your hand on your opponent. Like you have to recover this way. Oh, I love the way Hyper is chasing down uh, Zyme's uh, Ferrars. You can, you can punish it. Uh, the startup is there. It looks very hard to punish, but it's definitely possible. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm assuming Zyam knew that work. And and it's going to get interesting. You're right, it is going to get pretty interesting now. Because now Hyper knows it works, you know? Yeah, that was a very... Yeah, I'm excited to see where the recovery metagame is going to be between these two guys. Because it looks like they've got... Oh my gosh, their punishment of recoveries has been... Some of the best I've seen from both of both characters. Using Dins to read the roll. Okay, controlling space with that Din up there, but Hyper makes it down safely. He's not scared. Okay, and Zyme is I, evening it up. Yeah, it, he's got to be super careful though because so much can kill Zelda at this percentage. He's got something going though. Oh, oh, oh! Well, I, 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 I don't know. Done trying to guess. Here's the other thing we just saw Hyper do is he can actually magnet the dins. Yeah. Oh, super risky dins there by uh, by Trent, but uh. I, oh, oh goes for the Dacus, hard man. read. The Dacus. <laughs> These are my keys. What? Why are they there? They must have fallen out of my pocket or something. Drinking. I'm a mess. Yeah, you really I'm are. I'm a goddamn mess. Okay, high ceiling, short sides. Pretty much a per perfect recipe here for Zelda to uh, live a little bit longer and kill Lucas a little earlier. Yeah, but you know what? Hyper can get in closer faster. So that's the only thing I'm, I'm, I'd be worried about is the pressure that can be applied. Good point. And it's harder. It's going to be harder to set up dins unless you already knock, knock Hyper off the stage. Hyper's playing out of his mind. Wow. Wow. His aggression is just out of control. I, I, there's no stop. There's no pause. There's no rest. It's just a consistent thing. And I don't know if a lot of players can handle or have been in that grinder, you know? Yeah.
But there's that too. That's yeah. the other thing to think about is that up air is not going to kill Hyper as early as it as it has. Oh. Trent tried to challenge that uh, PK Thunder 2, but it didn't really work out for him. Wow. Over to up smash. Up tilt. I'm and, sorry. But and there was a punish there, though. I'm actually pretty surprised. Most characters can't do that because the pushback is so high, but the tether really helped, helped Hyper out there. There you go. <laughs> I was going to say, this should be a stock. All the time in the world, just line up that kick. Oh, wow. Super, super good forward tilt. That'll be kill off the top. All that started from that odd uh, exchange at the ledge. Trying to nair use now, seeing if that'll maybe disrupt uh, Hyper's magnets, but so far not really working out for him. Hyper is ready for the nair use. Hyper is just I, I don't feel like he's ever been not on top of it. Good stuff. Hyper is looking super, super dominant in this game, too. And look, he's showing off his Hyper tech skill as well. Ooh, oh my goodness, ooh, Hyper. Ooh. Oh my goodness, Hyper. Hyper, calm down. Calm down, boy. If Zyme can't figure something out, you might get your wish in Malachi. Well, I, you know, the thing about this is, like, what's happening for Zyme is Zyme is a kind of guy who wants you to play his game. He wants to get his setups. He wants to set up uh, his tech coverage with his PK, uh, sorry, PK fire, Dim's fire. And Hyper, just the way he plays is so smothering. There's like no space at all for for Trent to set up anything. Oh, okay, but he gets stuff off of dash attack as well. I mean, that was kind of nutty. If I'm Malachi and I'm seeing this, there's not a shot in hell I'm going sheep. I'm gonna I'm gonna be down smashing out of anything I can, trading anything I can. That's an interesting neutral play. air, neutral air, anything I can because oh the, my oh, god, did he get it? Hit him on the way up. Oh no. Okay, but he still covers it, and and Zyme is still in this. Chased him all the way. Had the right idea. Oh my gosh, this punish game that Zyme is so tether. well known for. Oh my gosh, is he's about to turn this around. Oh! Hyper, oh, is this it? Be it. Oh yeah. my gosh. That was so close. So there is, there is definitely there. adaption happening. Like, you can see it getting closer. Zyme is definitely figuring some things out. And he was able to punish more off the ledge. Zyme, Hyper Flame even clicks out with high APM. You see that? The yeah, right. I can't even make the noise. It was so fast. Beep, beep, beep. On it. Three, two, one. All right. This is a one of uh, Zyme's favorite stages. He's very good on final days. Well, we've seen what Hyper could do here. But yeah, that's the other thing is Hyper's got some stuff here too. Hyper just... Uh, okay. We do definitely take those, especially in, on a third game when you're on a tournament game, possibly. Can we talk about how insane it is that Zyme can go without playing this game and perform like this? Oh my gosh. That's the other thing we haven't talked about as much. Is, yeah, he barely even comes to local. Somebody in California was like, why is he so good? We're like, we don't know. He just stays and sits at home and plays net play. And then he just comes and bodies some really top players. Yeah. Oh! And breaks it up with a with a nice weak spot there. Oh my gosh, unbelievable a back air there. I like the way he throws the, the, the dims right above his head. Kind of stops Hyper from jumping around as much. Does stick to the dash dim. This is, oh, up smash is so good That's, on this That stage. was like the first time that he was able to get up smashes out, you know? Hasn't been, haven't seen it too much. Hyper's got him rolling oh right now. Oh my gosh. Dins is set up. Hyper not able to do anything with it. Oh, circling. Yep, that's extra damage. I don't know, man. If you're hyper right now, you want to... Oh, all right. Crawling. He's, he's 
He's walking up, man. If you're if you're hyper right now, like you want to end this now, game three. Yeah. Like the last dude in this venue that I want to give momentum to is is Zion. For sure. He just because he figures out things so quickly, you know. Seen he's very explosive. There's a dense fire somewhere. The camera's freaking out. There it is. Jabs him right into there and yep. sets up the up air. And yes, Hyperflame suicided a stop, but Zyme already has a, has a stop lead anyway. So definitely going to show you it's not just about that. I mean, the first Dude. stop was a big momentum. He's for Hyper well, he's also figuring out some weight right now, man. He's seeing what's working. And, and it, it's interesting because oh FD kind of gives you that. You know, it kind of teaches you the, the combo weight. You and start what to he feel it. I'm sorry, go ahead. No, no, no. He transformed in order to explode it early, which is something that very few Zeldas do, but uh, Zyme is a real expert at knowing how to... He actually has a lot of stuff with, with Dinspire I don't even understand. He actually sometimes found a way to... He found a way to burn it early. Like, mm -hmm. make it explode early, and there's... I don't know, he's got so much tech that I can't even comment on because it's very hard to tell. Uh, like, when he, like, makes uh, yeah. it go early. But he takes a game there. Yeah. JV3 also. What I was saying about FD is right, like right. you start to realize what combo weight the character is. You start right. to realize some DI. You start to realize some patterns. And now obviously they're not gonna go back to FD. I would I wouldn't think. But if they do, great. If they don't, you have a bit of an idea now. Like, cool. I can do this, this, and this. He'll probably hit the platform now. I know that on the second one, and I can follow up with something. You know, you. Maybe he didn't have that kind of information with him, and it's, he's already starting better than he did the first two games. Yeah. Low ceiling is gonna make a, killing a lot easier for both characters. Uh, up, you know, um, Zelda's up air is very powerful as well. Okay, just goes for a dash attack, no grab. Ooh, tries to space aerials there. Trying to get a, a big kick off that uh, air dodge. Or sorry, that's okay, that's good. Yeah. Oh, oh wow! I almost thought he like. I thought he fell through the stage. I did, yeah, like, the like classic. a PS one kind of thing. Exactly. I was freaked out. Oh, I produced another stock to an SD. This has been like an SD plague tournament for a lot of players. Yeah. And if you're hyper, you're gonna be super careful on the ledge now because you've already dropped one, but you don't want to get him. You're at three percent. Right. Like, you know, Lucas's recovery pretty predictable. Zyme is definitely trying to build up his percentage, but uh, Hyper playing it super yeah, well. Doing an excellent job, totally only taking 6%. Him. Totally denied him a lead despite an SD. Okay, okay, gets a lot of up airs out of it. Oh my oh gosh, man. Dins just limits you so hard, and, and Zyme is always ready. Fully charged, it's gonna take stock. Don't know if it would have mattered too much the other way either. Yeah. Not, Zelda pretty light. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I love the way he went right through the platform. Very smart way to escape that situation by uh, by Zyme. Sick SDI down. Oh! Dan's playing factor right at circling around. Oh no, they didn't actually save him that time. Could have had a uh, KO there. He definitely needs to deny Hyper uh, more percentage on the stock. And one down air. Oh my oh. god, up air. Dacus, man. And here it is, three stocks to one, Zyme tournament. Is, I, he only, I guess, uh, well, the thing is, uh, Hyper, Lucas only has one tether. So he went for the tether twice. Yeah. And it, 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 uh, it made man he died. Wow, going to Sheik in this last moment here. He's got a bit of a Sheik, but he definitely he definitely knows it's not on the level of, of like Malachi and David. He said that to me in the past. So, but maybe it's, a, maybe it's an option here. Maybe he'll be able to uh, camp Hyper Flame. Also, talk about change of pace. Yeah, definitely is changing the pace. Missing a lot of 
lot of moves that he needs right now. Oh my god, Hyper went I put so himself in a bad position. Good kick. That He's going to take nice some punishment. damage at the wow, very least. The camera is spazzing out. Yo, underneath the stage and everything. Oh, oh. went for the Dacus. I'm doing a much better job of playing just a patient game right now. Very tense for Zyme right now. Good Thanks stuff. One. Definitely doable for him. And Zyme right now. Oh my gosh. Gets a grab. Huge moment. This is going to lead to some him. stuff. Okay, Hyper Flame. If ah. you're, you're Zyme, you've got to be wary of the Dacus. He's already done it twice. He missed on one, got you with the other. Okay, don't get caught on the platform. Definitely not what you want. Oh, I power think he shield. went for it there, actually, after that PK freeze. Especially got to watch out with the Dins. The Dins can be punished from so far away with the Dakin. The Din is not, it's like, it's very laggy to throw out a Din. Is this it? Yeah, that could be it. That's and it, it. is. Nice Hyperplane takes a 3-1.